<laughs> Welcome to the episode of Space Engineers on the Radio Man 03, otherwise known as the Noob. Yes, the Noob. Here we are, back on the planet. Mm-hmm. Indeed. I have materials in my inventory, things to build. We want to get this ship up and running, hopefully, in this episode. God, I hope in this episode. Now, last episode, you guys were all screwed. Let me put this thing down here real quick. Uh... Boom. Okay, let me put that down. Um, <laughs> you were all probably screaming at me horribly going, Radio! Radio! Look at the other side of that, that cannon you have. There is uh, access points over here that I never looked at. We do have ammunition here now. We have 18 NATO ammo containers in here. As I learned last episode, uh, Zelia left me some comments, as did uh, a couple other folks leave me some comments as well. Indeed, I've also taken and put the uh, solar panels down flat. They are getting full sunshine, as you can see. We've got four bars of energy, just pure energy, pouring in and uh, filling up the batteries with lots of juice down below and powering the uh, lunar lander here. So we've got that going on. I have been hit by meteorites on a regular basis. We've got extra blocks up here now because we keep getting plowed by those dang meteorites. <sighs> We are going to try to get this ship up and running today. I believe I have everything I need for this large reactor for a small ship. This is the first thing we're going to put on, and then we are going to get busy and try to get this thing airborne. I would like to see us hopefully take off today and uh, not crash. <laughs> That'd be a good thing. I dug out the underneath here so we can actually access the undercarriage of the ship. Sort of like you would in a uh, an auto shop bay. You would have you know that, that sort of thing going on. So let's see, what do we have left for... Materials. Hope everyone's doing great. I'm doing pretty darn good. Not too bad. You know, still getting the feel for the game, obviously. Uh, I am the noob, uh, as if there was any other noob out there. I am the noob. Uh, let's put a gyro here. These are going to make us so we can uh, move around on the ship, make the ship move nice and easily. Uh, is that good? Do I, How do I have the other one? I want them. I want, I want this. I like my stuff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on there? I like my stuff looking nice, you know what I'm saying to you? Which way does this go? We're gonna need more computers. Okay, it's pointing upwards. Okay, so pointing upwards. And maybe that was not such a good idea to, to do that. Put that big gouge in the ground there underneath it. Anyways, we're, we've, that's, that's the way it is, that's the way it is. So let's put another one here. And we're gonna spin that sucker around. And like so. All right. And let's see what we can weld. Now, the gyroscope is going to keep us, so hopefully we can flip back over. Uh, when I was testing this game out on my own, I did wind up having my ship turn over on one side, and I could not get it back up in the other direction. So we wanted to make sure we have that. Uh, number eight. Ah, let's see here. How do we want our drills? This is going to be a mining ship, reconnaissance ship. That's the goal here today to get this guy going. What's, what's going on here? There we go. Oh, I don't have a... I need another block right here. Uh, four. Right down in... Right down in... No, right... Right, right in there. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm, that's what I'm looking for. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I would like to see this ship flying. There we go. I want those guys right here. And it's going to be a very basic ship. This one's going to allow us to go get some, some ores mined up real quick. And it's going to also enable us to, uh, you know, do some reconnaissance. Yeah, do some reconnaissance. Well, now why won't I, Oh, you know what? I bet I need... Yeah, do I not have steel plates? It's, it says I've got everything I need. Why won't it let me put that on there? And... Huh. Weird. Okay. Oh, wrong button. Let me see. Let me get... Uh, well, it won't let me put it anywhere. So I, I need... I, obviously, I'm, I'm out of material that I need. What do I What do I need here? Uh, I've got plates. Everything else. What does this, this require? Steel plate. Construction components. Small steel tube. Large steel tube. Motor. Computer. Okay. Come on, drill. Why won't you behave yourself? Yeah, 
Is it because it's not far enough off the... Oh, you know what? I bet, it, I bet the drill is touching these blocks in front of it here. That's what's happening. All right, so actually what we need to do is we're going to have to take out... Ooh, it looks like that's attached to that one though. I don't want I don't want to I don't want the ship to fall down in there. Let's see if it'll let me do that now. There we go, that's it. In the hole we go. In the hole we go. I swear to god, you guys bear with me. It's gonna be it's it'll be worth it. Yeah, I think we've got a problem with it's not up high enough off that block and it's seeing it doesn't want to attach there because it's okay. Let me let me let's try something here, guys. Let's try, let's try putting uh, one more here and one more here. We'll try the same thing over here and right here. Up a little higher is no big deal. Okay, and let's try that again. There it goes. Yeah, it's just because we have. It is because we have it too low to the ground. Like so. Excellent. Okay, so let's go ahead and put these blocks back so we don't fall in the hole anymore. And we're good to go. We're going to need construction components and computers, it looks like. That's okay. We could do that. And we're lots of thrusters. Lots of thrusters. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thrusters. Oh, uh, uh, construction components and th computers. Construction components and computers. The refinery has been working. 10, 20, oh, I'll just take all of them. Yeah, let's take all of them. <laughs> let's take those. And uh, what else do I need? Uh, construct and construction components. Let's grab a bunch of those. And I think we're okay for a little bit. No, you know what? Motors. It seems, oh, we got 139 on us. So we're probably pretty good on motors. Okay. Ooh, she's coming together, folks. She's coming together. There we go. That's right. Finish up that gyro. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful gyro. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, these meteor showers. Holy crap. I can see why people complain about it. I mean, it's just... They are devastating. Absolutely devastating. Every time there is one, I mean, it is right here, too. You just got to watch out. Fortunately, the turret does do a pretty good job. We could probably use a few more, but the magnesium, we just don't have enough, and it takes so long to go out by hand to get it that it's just that doesn't seem worth it to me. All right, so here we are with this. If I get in here... No fuel. Yeah, I'm taking damage. Okay, yeah, we don't have any power to this, so that's why we, we're taking damage. All right, so number seven, this is going to be our ore detector. And let's go ahead and put that bad boy... Right here. Detector component. Okay, a detector component. Hmm, very interesting. A detector component. Do we have any of those? I do not know. Right now, everything is turned off. Detector component. Detector component. Let's go to control panel. Production. Detector component. Uh, and then we got to go to the control panel. Assembler on. And now we have one. Ha ha ha. Better nice. But nice indeed. Mm, thank you very much. Uh, how are we doing on components here? The drills are already up and going, so we're going to need more stuff, I imagine, once we get... Uh, we're going to have to put the th decide where we're going to put the thrusters and stuff like that, so that'll be, that'll be fun. That's going to be fun. The thrusters. Oh, yes, the thrusters. There we go. Ore detector. Now, this guy, unfortunately, we're going to have to be close to the ground in order to see what it is we're looking for in ores, but uh, we've got one on there, so that's the main thing. So what else do I have on here that I need to get put into place? The thrusters. All right. Um, thrusters. Thrusters, thrusters, thrusters. We are going to do... We need to actually spin this boy, bad boy around like that. And we're going to do one, one on top of it and then one off to the side of it. Hmm. Actually, we want them right here. On the end. Right on the end. There we go. And let's try that again. They're beautiful, aren't they? I think they're really cool looking. Really cool looking. We want six across the back. At least that's what I want. 
Mm -hmm. And wow, that is a little bit. See, I'm trying to keep us keep everything tucked in be in inside the drills, so that when the drills are working, well, we're not going to hopefully have to go in that far because we're going to be mining the nodes with this guy here. Uh, you need to turn around. Did I do this with the other ones? No, we want this one this way. There we go. There we go, like so. So we have six pushing us, propelling us forward. Come on, up. There we go. We're going to need some propelling us backwards as well. And so that means we need to spin these guys around. There we go. Nothing like watching a new guy do this, huh? That's right. That's right. <laughs> this one's going to back us out of the hole. I hope those don't burn. Can we stack one more on top? I'd like to have three forward, three backwards. Come on now. There we go. Let's just do it this way. All right. Beautiful, huh? All right, metal grids. Okay, we're going to need metal grids for these guys. All right, metal grids it looks like right now. Okay, and so we've got three forward, three backwards, six forward, six backwards, and then we're going to need a few more. So what do we say? We needed some more grids. Mm -hmm. We're going to need a little bit of everything, actually. Let's go 10, 20. And we've got steel plates, so we're good there. Let's go with some more construction components. And let's grab a couple more motors. And we might as well grab... A few more steel tubes. We've got a little bit more space, and let's grab some computers. Where are the computers at? Am I out of computers? Uh, it looks like I might be out of computers. Yes. Okay, so back to production. Let's get, uh, let's get 50 of those going. We'll come back later for those. Bum, ba, bum, 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 bum. We are building a spaceship. On the planet. <laughs> ah, lovely. Once we put uranium in that bad boy back there, we'll see if we've got enough juice to get up and down. Alright, lovely. We're doing really well. We're doing pretty good. I'm actually <laughs> kind of surprised. <laughs> There we go. Listen to that. Listen to that welding going on. Oh, such hard work. Such hard work, but so rewarding. So very rewarding. Come on, baby. Do we have enough stuff to get through this project? Oh, crap. Do your job, turret. Where's it coming from? Oh god, it's right above us. Don't you don't you come at my ship. Don't you come at my ship. Get it, get it. He's not shooting them all. He's not getting them. There for a while he was actually it was the, the turret was actually doing a really good job and getting a lot of them, but holy crap, he's not doing such a great job anymore. He needs help. And he goes through ammo like crazy. Like, see those guys are getting through. All right, looks like it's over with. Uh, what was it? What is it? What is it that I needed? I needed uh, more motors. Oh man! Yeah, a couple of those hit the corner of the ship. Just blew it to smithereens, man. I tell you, it is just brutal. Uh, wow, that was two hundred. I did not want two hundred. There we go. A hundred of those would be good. Um, we've got some grids left. We needed. Well, we'll just leave, we'll leave that on for now. We'll leave that on for now. 
Yeah, the batteries have got... Yeah, the batteries are doing pretty good. As you can see, they've got three bars in them. So they're doing all right. They're doing just fine. Okay, we got all these... We got all these taken care of. Uh, except for this one right here. Excellent. All right. And now we're on the back set. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is beautiful. I'm going to sip my coffee while we're sitting here welding real hard like this. Hope everyone's doing great. If I haven't said that already today, I am doing fantastic. Hopefully, I can get two episodes back to back. Just to let you know, I'm doing Space Engineer episodes as I can. Main series is Life in the Woods, and then I've got Rising World as well. But uh, I wanted a couple other games that I could play that I could have fun with and hopefully entertain you guys with. And, you know, variety is the spice of life. It is. It certainly is. So you got to have a little variety in life. Otherwise, things just get kind of, you know, you got to have it. Uh, no, no, no. That's how we want you there. And then we want you to, we want you to spin upwards. There we go. That's, that's it. Okay, so these are going to be... Our downward thrusters. Can I not? I can't put those right there, huh? Okay, note to self. Always have a little extra space. Always have a little extra space underneath the ship when you're building. I guess you can always come back and grind that stuff off, can't you? Yeah. Yeah, I should have gone up a little bit off that landing gear. I just wanted to keep the landing gear nice and tight to the ship so that I didn't have to worry about it uh, getting busted off. Okay, these are our downward thrusters, and then we're going to need up thrusters, and we also need left and right. Uh, do I need this many of these? Left and right, we're going we're gonna, to... What do I need? More motors. Left and right, I'm going to go ahead and uh, just do one on each side and see if that doesn't uh, work okay for it. We'll see. Uh, and here we go. And we needed more motors, so let's grab 40 of those. Let's grab a few more of those, actually. And then we're, it looks like we're getting a little low on the grids. Construction components. Computers are fine. I don't even think we're using the, the steel tubes and stuff. We'll see. There we go. Beautiful. And we've got a little room on the back of this ship in case we want to add like a cargo container and stuff like that. We'll be able to do something like that. There we go. Excellent. Now, did I get the other side all welded up? They're all taken care of, these guys here? Yes. Okay. Beautiful. Now, we need to go back and forth, left and right. And let's try one of these guys. Um, let's see if we can get up on the back of the ship. There we go. And we're going to go... I don't think it likes the fact that I'm standing in the way. Hmm. Okay, let's do one there. Can I squeeze another one in here somewhere? Like right up in here? No. How about if we... What if we do a number four, a block right here? Go back to the nine. There we go. Now we can do that. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay. We want ice, too. We got to get some hydrogen going. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and take this guy off. Let's add this guy right into here, and then we will go back up on top of the ship. And let's see, where do we put that block? Right there, okay. And then we had to put a block right there. So, beautiful. Perfect. And spin, spin. There we go. Motors again. Motor, right? I got you. We'll get motors for you. We'll get some motors for you, I promise. Daddy always keeps his promises, little ship. And we can paint this ship too, which is really kind of cool, I think. Okay, we're going to weld that up right there. 
I'm going to come up with a better way of doing this to where we can be underneath the ship and, and put things on it and not worry about not having space for stuff. Uh, which way was this supposed to be going? Okay, so, okay, this has got to spin around. Is that right? Yeah. Motors. I oh, know. We need more motors. More motors. We'll get more motors. And then nine here, and... This spins around as well, and we're good to go right there. And do we get this one over here put in? We did get that one put in. Okay, so we need more motors. A few more of those guys. We're almost there. We are almost there. Uh, wow, wow, we really, really burn it through the motors, huh? Okay, so I can see motors are really important. Good to know. Good to know. Motor production is going to be very important for the future. The future of this exploration of the planets that we have so close to us now. Uh, real soon, what I want to be able to do, and, and this guy's going to help us out too with uh, with doing a little little base digging as well. Okay. A little base digging. All right. And how are we doing over here? We're all welded in there. Okay, we're doing good there. And we got this guy right here. Okay, so let's check. We've got six forward. We have six backwards. We have two down and two... Four down and... Right? Four, four down. There's four down. Hmm. Where are my up thrusters at? That is... Ha ha ha! Yeah, that'd be just like me to take off, too. I wouldn't be able to take off. I have no up thrusters. Okay, so now we need to do this a little bit more. So let's go ahead and uh, spin this guy around here. And I actually want that in the back. There we go. Oh, man. This is really a... Uh... Will this let me put that on there now? It will. Okay, so... Okay. Hopefully this will be enough. Motors. Motors, 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 and more motors. Let's get the other two in place. Uh, we're going to have to grind this panel away right here. And then we can do this. Hopefully it'll let me do it. Ah, it's not. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Um, and it is actually locked on to that one right there. I suppose I could move it forward just a little bit. We could, we could fire it up and move it forward. It actually needs to move backwards is what it needs to move, huh? Okay, um, give me a second and I'll be right back. I'm going to get some more materials and kind of work out this little problem of getting these last two thrusters on here. All right, I've... I've just kind of... kind of placed a couple of them over there. <laughs> That's all I did. Uh, we need to get to the um, reactor here. Ooh, no, 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 no. I don't want to turn the inertia, inertia dampers off. There we go. Okay. Whew, okay. So if we go right here, I should be able to put this uranium in here, and this should fire up all the... G react... Okay. Everybody's on. I'm hoping that's enough power. It's on. And then I need to go K okay, to the control panel. And where is the vent? Air vent. Uh, depressurize. There we go. Now we're getting oxygen. 
<sighs> power usage is 0 0.02. Um, if I hit P, it'll take off the landing gear. Nothing is happening. Landing gear is still on. It should have been a, a, a hit P. Let's see here. Let's go back to the control panel. Landing gear incomplete. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Um, landing gear is incomplete. There we go. Okay, here we go. Let's see. We've got enough. We've got enough hovering ability. Let's scroll out a little bit. We're not getting over any overloads on our power. Ooh, I think we did it. I think we have successfully built a ship. Okay, let's see if we can fix these thrusters. Um, I'm a little worried about this now. Let's get a number nine on here. Oh, it's starting to sink a little bit. Oh, no, number four, I moved it, that's right, okay. And this is supposed to go right here, and this one right here. Hopefully we've got enough stuff for this, guys. Okay, and then let's grind this one off. Uh-oh. My computer screen just went black when I did that. It did not like that. Let's see if it does it again. Okay, okay, we're good there. How are we looking? We're looking pretty good. It flies. doing really good. <laughs> it's flying. I do not know how to set the drills up. Okay. Large reactor landing gear. I'm going to have to learn how... What is this? Why is this one red? Atmospheric thruster. Why why is that one red? Do I have a thruster not working right now? There we go. There we go. Alright, now we got them all. Okay, so now I go K, and I've got my 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 drill drills. Where are the drills at? I'm so excited here. Hold Shift, turn them on. Let's see about getting us some of this uranium. I'm gonna take it nice and easy in here. See about grinding this out. There, there's storage space in the drills themselves, and that's why I don't have a storage container in here. I really wanted to just get something kind of up and running. Right now, all we're going to be doing is getting stone. Well, she's turning really well.
think I'm bumping into stuff. We kind of got to get this all ground away. Keeping our horizon bar nice and straight as best I can. And keeping an eye on our weight. Oh, this is sweet. I think I'm bumping into this down here. Sorry if I'm quiet. I'm very excited about this. About 123. So let's go back to K. Let's take our drills. Turn them off. I have to set them up on a block so that I can actually just uh, do it all at once. You would be. You would be inbound. Oh, we are so heavy right now. <laughs> the ship's over there just shooting away. Oh, jeez. Oh, God, they're coming after us. Oh, there's, there's more coming. We're going to go really slow. Back to back to the ship. I can't I can't get the ship to go up anymore. We may need another couple thrusters pushing us up because <laughs> we are really heavy right now with stone. This should be almost over with. Looks like it's over. Excellent. Okay, we're gonna go up to our ship. We're gonna take this stuff. Uh, we got a bunch of stone in here. We're gonna transfer transfer this out of here. No, I can't do that. We just transfer it out and get rid of it. I did this once before when I was kind of just messing around with the game and I wound up sending the ship into orbit. It seemed like, oh, this is just so much stone. Holy crap. This is a hard way to do it. There is a thing we can put on the back of the ship, on the underside of it, that will actually let the stone fall out of it as it mines it. Okay, so there's that. need to get this other one here too. I, I, would have to, I would have to say though this is a pretty successful trip so far. I think I'm hitting the ship with that. I don't know. It looks like it might be rolling off a little bit. We just want the uranium. Alright, there. We, now we should be good. There we go. Well, now we have some lift. Now we can get up off the ground. Oh, sweet. Okay, guys, there you go. What do you think? Huh? Not too bad for our first little ship. We're going to have to get it painted up and stuff, though, too. You can hear those dampeners kicking in when we, when we slow down. Really awesome. Really, really awesome. And we got to paint it. we got to get it painted. And we're going to get this leveled out. Like so. We're gonna come in nice and easy here. And I think I might cause some damage to our thrusters because uh, I think if we go V, we can actually see what we're doing here. We have contact, we hit P, that locks us into place. Oh, F. Gets us out of the cockpit, and bam! We're good to go. Ha! It worked! It worked! Oh my god, I know, I know, right? 
What's the big deal, radio? I'll tell you what the big deal is, is I made it work. We gotta put these guys on a thing too. And we turn those off. And and we're we are good to go. Look at that. We are good to go. Uh what what's going on here? There we go. I was in B. Oh man, okay, so let's take a look and see what we got for uranium. So much we can't even carry it all in one shot. That's excellent. I have no idea how much gas we have left. So let's go to the refinery. We're going to dump that in. We're going to go to control panel. We're going to turn on our refinery and on you go. What's the matter? Oh, our batteries are all off. We've got no power. There we go. Back to the control panel. Maybe this will work better, huh? <laughs> no. Um, production. No. Back to the control panel. Batteries. And we want this off. Semi-auto for all of them. Now, is that going to work? Uh, where is it again? Refinery. There it goes. Okay, there it goes. It had no power. You got to have power, right? You got to have the power. Okay, so next episode, it's getting dark, so I don't want to be. I don't want to be out here at night, uh, zipping around. So what we're going to do is uh, next episode. We're going to go and uh, take a look at this this mountain here that we're on top of and see if there's some way we can uh, get kind of a, a little base going. At least dig a hole and get that, that part going. Uh, let's go back into here. And let's get the uranium going again. Because we've, uh, we've got some good stuff going. We've got some good materials going. We're able to build a small ship, which is nice. Uh, we do need to go out and get ice. So maybe that's the next episode. We'll go out and get some, uh, some ice like we need. And uh, we'll be able to you know have uh, plenty of hydrogen going on so that we can fill our bottles on a regular basis and make sure we have what we need to uh, you know survive have our jet pack going on and off like it does we, we use the jet pack quite a bit so we'll have to make sure we go out and get some ice I know there's some nearby here we saw it as we came in so I'm really happy about that oh man look at that okay we've we, we've got we did some good today guys we did some good we definitely did some good yeah we did we did I'm very excited about this. Yeah. Let's get this dropping in here. And it should automatically go into... There we go. Oxygen generator. Just takes a second for it to do it. But there we go. We have our first ship. We can put a cargo container on the back. And uh, a small one. And then we should be able to carry a little more material. It looks like we may not have enough thrusters to get the job done. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. And I also need to work on some kind of a landing pad where the ship uh, isn't burning the metal because the, the, the thrusters will cause damage to the metal below. So yeah, and uh, maybe it needs a battery on there as well. I don't know. We've got all kinds of stuff to play with, but there's our first little ship. It worked just fine. We had a little bit of a weight issue, but uh, so far so good. Yeah, so far so good. I'm pretty happy with that. That's a, that's a pretty productive day for me. <laughs> so, like, comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 and I so do appreciate your time. Have an awesome, fantastic, and superb day, and I look forward to talking to you again next time.